What's up, everybody? Justin here, bringing you another poorly reviewed beer from Rusty Rail Brewing Company, Mifflinburg, Pennsylvania. This is Rail Spike IPA. Notes from the brewer. Known for their incredible strength, railroad spikes were hammered deep into the ground in order to hold tracks together and keep massive steam trains on course. Forged from Centennial, Columbus, Simcoe, Chinook, and Cascade hops, our Rail Spike IPA delivers a sharp flavor as strong and dependable as the hardware it is named for. 7.1% ABV, 72 IBUs. Uh, you heard the malts used. Oh, I'm sorry, you heard the hops used. Uh, malts used included Pale Two Row, Munich Light 10 L, and Carapils. So let's check this beer out. It's finally coming around. About two fingers, I would say. Right now, just out of the bottle. Uh, nice, kind of pure gold color. I would say, as I hold up to the light. Uh, still holds, holds the same color pretty well. Yellow, yellowish highlights, kind of apple juice colored highlights. I can see a moderate amount of carbonation shooting up through the glass. It's generally pretty well see-through maybe just a a little bit of haze in the thickest uh or in the widest parts of the glass where you have more beer going through but i can see my fingers on the other side of the glass fairly well let's go ahead and try it hmm. very different ipa uh, flavor profile than most of your ipas It is spicy. I feel like I'm maybe getting a little bit of citrus, a little bit of a a, a dank note, maybe a little bit of a pine or a, a resiny note. Moderately, uh, moderately bitter. I feel like there's some, some malt forwardness there as well. Hmm. So yeah, really different, uh, really interesting and nice, uh, flavor balance coming out of the hop flavors. Uh, again, I talked about maybe just a little bit of citrus, a little bit of maybe grapefruit or orange, orange candy, perhaps. Bit of a pine note, but lots of, uh, lots of herbal, lots of floral to me. And there's a bit of a hop forward, forwardness to it as well, that, um... Makes for a different flavor makeup and a unique flavor makeup for an IPA uh, that I'm enjoying, especially as a little bit more of a, a malt guy than a hop guy. Yeah, nice, different, unique flavor profile overall. Fairly heavy on the, the tongue to me, I think. Me medium, I guess it's probably a medium body, but... Uh, the aftertaste is pretty massive. Uh, a lot of bitterness hangs around. You kind of get more of the pine in the uh, after you've had the you've gone through the drinking experience. So uh, yeah, that's kind of um, I think I've kind of hit on everything. Let me see if I can get anything else. Just a, maybe a little bit of a a brain note from that malt forwardness, but. Um, nice balance in a lot of ways, this uh, this beer, this uh, Rail Spike IPA. So that does it for this edition of Poorly Reviewed Beer. You can find all my reviews, video, and written, along with news, commentary, and more at poorlyreviewedbeer.com. Also check out PRB on Twitter and Facebook, as well as uh, Instagram and Untapped. 
You'll find all those links and usernames in the description below. Also, feel free to like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around at Poorly Reviewed Beer.